Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Animate Dimension. Today I will showcase more on Sasuke. Sasuke is a 450 gem um, character. He is a mid character is because he has 450 gems. So let's try Sasuke. And also I reached 47 level in between episodes. So curse dimension. Easy create start. I will showcase you if Sasuke a good character or be or very bad character. It's either I will not compare it with 1600 gems character, I will compare it with four five hundred to 300 in between gems character so yeah so okay dash i didn't use sasuke before so okay fireball not bad burn damage chidori it's really annoying chidori because it's because chidori is not a really good area attack so Kir i should use kirin here to see how strong is kirin okay i would I don't really like that I take so much damage. It's a little bit annoying to take that much damage. I so dash Amaterasu Shidori again. Okay, yeah, Sasuke is really bad compared to Akaza that you can get it from the demon dimension. His Chidori is a little bit too short range. That's the annoying part. Amaterasu is okay, but you it's only a small area of places. So yeah. Fireball is not bad, it's a semi range. Chidori, I just don't have Chidori that you that's kinda of. Let's see how good he he when how good Sasuke when you fight the boss? Chidori I met Chidori Oh my god that sucks Fireball Kirin Hopefully Kirin can kill most of the enemy For me I don't recommend you to use Sasuke It's not that worth it I think I recommend you guys to use Sasuke in... Actually no, Sasuke is below average for, in my opinion. The range is not that good, the area damage is not that good also. The only good thing is his fireball and Amaterasu is okay. It's not the longer range, but it's okay. Kirin is not bad, Chidori is, the, is not that good, it sucks. So yeah, that's the that's the bad part, the Chidori part. If from in my opinion, I recommend you if you guys want to use below five hundred gems unit, the best one should be used Yakaza, or maybe Tanjiro is okay, in my opinion lah. So Fireball, Amaterasu, Chidori. I can't even reach them. That's so annoying. Okay, there we go. Okay, this part is a little bit annoying because I need to lure all of them together first compared to later I will show you. Okay, and then Kirin. Ooh. And I'm dead. And you also stay there, you can't get any invisible power. So that sucks. Chidori. Okay, teleport to the boss. King of Curse. I mean, I'm, I can say I'm struggling. This is not the normal gameplay of me. If I am, I have done much better than this. And I also silent the sound of fighting because I realize that the video is really hard to hear when I do not like to do the fighting sound. Ooh. Yeah, I'm dead. Okay. Okay, I can do Kirin. Kiri, Fireball, Dutch, Amaterasu, Shidori, Kiri. I will get a little bit invisibility, but just for a while, it's not that long period, so that's not good. 
And Kirin is so... I can't see anything using Kirin. So... The final result for Sasuke, in my opinion, will be below average. I recommend don't use Sasuke if you don't have other choice. If you have other choice, don't use Sasuke. He is so little hell, come on! Just die already, boss. Fireball? There we go. Finally. Sasuke is real average, in my opinion. Don't recommend it using Sasuke. At least I still get S tier because, of course, because I have legendary card of the of the updated curse dimension. And also, I realized uh, the last video, I don't know what is the meaning of JJK. It's Jujutsu Kaisen update. The curse dimension is from Jujutsu Kaisen. I don't watch that anime yet because I don't have the time to watch it. But if you guys recommend me to try to watch that show, I think I will try it. So, final result is Sasuke is below average. In my opinion, use Yakaza. Ita Baru Bori is not that bad too if you want to mid mid term character. Mid term character is Tanjiro, Sasuke, Yakaza, Pasta, and Itabari. So I think that's all for today's video. Thank you everyone for watching my video and I will see you again. Bye bye.